His advisor, the brilliant Count Mikhail Speransky, reformed administration and finance. Yet the Emperor refused to back his plans for a liberal constitution. Yeah, I was going to say, yeah, Speransky, he did definitely achieve some reforms, but his like his idea of a constitution and many of his major reforms didn't work. They didn't go through because Alexander would support them. Alexander, like all of these European monarchs, was very spooked by the French Revolution. Uh, and he was worried that Speransky was trying to introduce this, you know, French Enlightenment liberal policy to his country. And so Alexander refused to back the more radical and wide-ranging reforms that Speransky introduced. Um, those Speransky definitely did see some success, um, but really not to the extent uh, he hoped.